Hello, I'm here to do a quick video on this yarn that I really love. I, um, before I purchased it, I tried finding some videos on this yarn and didn't really find um, many videos, I guess. Uh, not sure if people aren't buying it because of the price, um, but I just want to kind of give you a quick review, my quick review of this yarn. It's Whale's Big Grand by Loops and Threads and you get 306 yards 10.58 ounces 280 meters 300 grams it's a hundred percent acrylic yarn it's considered a medium number four yarn but in my opinion it works up um, bigger than that um, but yeah um, I say this um, particular yarn is great for sweaters. It's great if you want to um, make a bag of some sort. Um, I'm trying to think. Normally when you do like blankets, you want it something extremely soft. This is not an extremely soft yarn. It's it's um it's not itchy. I can't even explain it. It's in my opinion, it's perfect for sweaters. It's, I I love it. It's not scratchy. It's not itchy. It's um um soft on the skin. But it's it's a tough yarn. Like it it, it will hold up really well. Um, I in the past I knit a sweater. And I was so excited to do it. I purchased 12 balls of the yarn. And by the time I finished the project, it looked like I had it for 7 years and 12 months. <laughs> that made no sense. That's 8 years. <laughs> but you know what I mean. It looked really old. So um, it was a waste. I never even wear the um, sweater. Um, I believe I have some photos of that. I'll I'll insert some some pictures of it if I do. Um, just keep in mind it does show up a little. Um, it shows up better on camera than it does in person. But I actually do not wear that jacket. Um, I, the only time I wear that particular jacket is if I'm just doing laundry or something like that. Um, other than that, it's just it was just a waste of money because the yarn just shed, shed, shed. It has all these little fuzzies all over it. It just looks ratty. Look, I just took a piece off of it. That's from the yarn that I don't like. And besides that, when I needed help doing one of the patterns, I contacted the company, and the response I got was a bit cold, um, borderline rude. Um, I, I came to a point in the pattern where it, it what they were telling me to do, it seems as though I um, would be left with a certain amount of stitches that would be more than what they said in the pattern. So I, I said, well, when I get to a certain point, am I supposed to do A or am I supposed to do B? And the response was pretty much, yeah. Rather than answering the question, they just said, yeah. And then when I um, I emailed again to say, well, I'm you know please bear with me, blah blah blah, and it was just really short. It wasn't um, they weren't really help that helpful. It was it was like they didn't really feel like being bothered because they could tell that I wasn't an experienced knitter. Sorry, I'm not an experienced knitter. I'm I'm I love knitting. But I'm learning along the way, and um, so whatever. I don't want to get into that. That's a whole big thing. Bottom line is, I'll I stopped purchasing their yarn altogether after that experience, and on top of that, I've just started trying to learn how to knit my own projects. I know how things, how I like things to fit me. So I've been just measuring my body before I start my work and knitting my own. So with um, the Whale's Big yarn by Loops and Threads, I knit a sweater. If I can get that over here. 
this is a sweater. Um, as you can see, the stitches show up beautifully. It's a cardigan. Oh, sorry, I can't. I think I may have photos of this so you can see the full video. But, um, yeah. It knits up really well. It, it's really nice. There are no fuzzies. Um, after I completed the project. So it still looks new. Um, so yeah. I really liked using this yarn. This particular color is I'm trying to zoom in, you guys. But anyway, it's this color is three three zero one purple violet morado. If I can, I'm trying to zoom in for you guys. I am having trouble here. There you go. See, that's the color. 3301. I purchased this at Michael's. Um, it is $9.99 a ball. Um, so if if that's not something you're looking to spend, maybe you can try to um, get it on sale, get, um, use coupons. But either way, I, I suggest trying this yarn. Um, in my local store, in my local Michaels, um, they only keep a few colors on hand, which is ugh. Um, so um, this was my, my first color, this purple. But I did order two more colors. Uh, gray and uh, the wine and um, so when I do something with that I'll come back on and show you guys what that looks like. I've also um, purchased the Wales Braid Big Yarn and I knit something with that so if you'd like to see um, how that works up just let me know in the comments below and I'll do another video with that yarn giving you just showing you what it works up like and giving you my opinion on the um, item so I guess that's it for now guys um, until next time thank you bye thanks for watching <laughs> bye